Wild hosting the Kraken, and the Kraken are plus 120 on the money line. The Wild are minus 140. The over-under is six goals. The Kraken getting a goal and a half on the puck line are minus 225. The Wild laying a goal and a half on the puck line are plus 180. Both of these teams won the last game that they played. Now understand these are the overnight odds. They're going to change the closer we get to puck drop tomorrow. Before you bet on this game, go to a site like VegasInsider.com. It'll allow you to compare all the casino's pricings, whether you bet online or in person. And then use a website like Covers.com. It is totally free. We'll have every gambling stat known to man in this matchup. And then it'll also show you who was in net and who may or may not be playing in tomorrow's game. Head to head, the road team is three and two in their five meetings. The Wild are three and two against the Kraken in their five meetings. The favorite is three and two on the money line. The underdog, though, getting a goal and a half on the puck line is three and two. There's only been one one goal game, ironically enough, in their last handful of games. The under is three uh, has hit in their last two games. The under is three and two in their last ten, and the under six is three one and one. The last game that they played. The Wild won 1-0 in Seattle. The game before that, Seattle won 4-0 in Minnesota. The game before that, Minnesota won 6-3. The game before that, Minnesota won 4-2. And the game before that, the Kraken won 4-1. Now in their last handful of games overall, the Kraken are 5-5 in their last 10. And the over is 7-3 in their last 10 games. We've had 9 goals, 3 goals, 9 goals, and 10 goals in the Kraken's last 4. They've scored 7, 1, 5, and four in their last handful of games. And one, two, three, four, five of their last 10 games that they've played have gone into overtime or a shootout. That's for the Kraken. Now the Wild are six and four in their last 10. And the over is seven and three in their last 10 games as well. We've had four goals, nine goals, three goals, and eight goals. They've scored three, four, three, and five in their last handful. Two out of their last three games have gone into overtime and four out of their last 10 have gone into overtime. So just saying that these things with laws of averages are going to happen. I'm going to take the wild on the money line. I'm going to take the crack in getting the goals and I'm going to go over because both of these teams are trending over and let's hope for a four to three or a five to four kind of exciting overtime game. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.